if you have a Pentair and Telechlor system like this here and you go to turn on your salt cell and nothing happens after you turn it on. And you turn on your pool, you notice that your salt cell doesn't activate. All the lights stay off like in this one here. Chances are the fuse has blown in the power unit right here. Okay, so you turn the pool off and we're going to inspect the fuse here. The fuse for the power unit is located right behind the cord for the cell. You'll see a little black box here with a circle. I'll just put a screwdriver in here, give it a turn. It should pop out. Sometimes it's stuck in there. Okay, once it pops out with the screwdriver, you can just pull it out the rest of the way. Sometimes it's in there pretty good. You might need to get the screwdriver and kind of nudge it out. You should be able to slide it out at that point. And you can see on the bottom it has a little notch for the screwdriver to get it out. The fuse just slides right out of there, leaving that. This is what you're looking for when you look at the fuse to see if it's broken. You can see that inside there is not connected together. It's got a snap. I'll show you. Take your new fuse and you'll slide it in. Make sure it's in there firm. Kind of push it in there. You want to come back over here with it. We'll stick it back up in there. Sometimes it'll stay in by itself. Sometimes you have to hold it with a screwdriver have to get it in there. You want to push all the way up and then turn it and it'll click in. You'll know it's in there because you hear a little bit of a click sound when it goes all the way in there. And you can buy these fuses at Radio Shack. Usually they're 1 1 4th amp fuses. You can also buy the pack of them through Jandy. If you're a pool service technician, you might want to get a pack of them. That way you have them handy. And Jandy sells the same exact fuse for the, their chlorinator. Okay, I'm going to turn everything back on. You should have lights now. And you can see it starting to light up now. So everything is working fine now. And it was just the fuse that was blown in there. And that's very common. So what happens when the cell starts to get dirty and the cell gets older, it'll create an arch with the electricity and it'll bridge the plates and that'll cause the fuse to blow out. So you want to clean your cell thoroughly at that point. Again, this happens when the cell starts to get older. This one here is about four years old. So clean your salt cell. This, I have a video on how to do that. This is not pure acid. This is acid, about one-eighth acid and the rest is water. And you can see it bubbling. That's all the calcium bubbling up. You want to use it. The weaker the acid makes, the better. The strongest you want to use is one to four. See, after about 15 minutes, it's pretty clean. I'm going to hose it out. I'm going to hose it out. And you can see that there's no more calcium connecting the plates together. And you can see the calcium bridge that was there is gone. So that's what causes the fuse to blow if you have too much buildup in your cell. And if the cell is getting older, it can't handle the extra voltage.